and it's December Daily Time 2017. I'm so glad you're joining me. I'm going to be showing you a review or not review, but preview of the products that I'm going to be using for my December 2017 album. Now I know what some of you are saying. If you follow me on Facebook or Instagram, you're probably like, Victoria, you talked about doing this or not doing this. You said, oh, well, there's somebody in the world who's doing December Daily and that person's not me. Well, you know what? I changed my mind. After reviewing what I've learned about December Daily from Allie Edwards, I took her online class about two years ago. I've been following the December Daily Facebook page. I've been seeing all the wonderful December Daily projects that are coming along and people doing their foundation pages and all the product. I'm like, I'm going to do it. So this is going to be my simple December Daily album. I want to keep it focused primarily on the story. There's not going to be a whole ton of embellishing, but it's going to still be great, clean, simple design that I think you guys will like. So let's jump into the product preview. So what I have here is like the equivalent of getting a Dooney bag, in my opinion. This is my December Daily album, and I got this from Felicity Jane. Now, those of you who've been following me for a while know that I sit on their creative media team, which is the design team, and um, Felicity Jane doesn't do a dedicated December kit, but they do a December Daily type holiday kit and it's called joy so make sure you check that out the link is posted down below you have a choice of two albums one's a floral album one's this plaid album which i'm going to show you here in just a second but when you get your album guys it comes in this great little silk bag has felicity jane here on the front and a precious heart here on the back so let me go ahead and open this up because i know you're like victoria show us already so i'm going to do that now i like these little bags because i could probably use this for something else down the road so i'm just going to set this to the side and here is the album how beautiful is this there's no hardware on the spine but that's okay if you want to add a little tag or something you can attach something here to the metal brackets and have it kind of hang over if you want but there is metal hardware gold hardware here on the side so you don't bang up the edges of your album and the album does come with some page protectors so you have these six ring albums and i think this would be compatible with other of these six by eight pocket page things like a becky higgins brand and it comes with all these wonderful page protectors here so you have a set of the page protectors that have the four three by three photos and then one with the two three by um, I'm sorry three by four rather and then the one with three by four here on the top four by six on the bottom and then the four by six and then the six by eight and I believe there's four of each and of course you can add to that as you see fit look at this gorgeous gold metal uh, binding clips here which I absolutely love that's beautiful beautiful I think it's perfect for an album like this and I just love the pattern it's so nice the album's really nice soft faux leather and I think it'll look really attractive on your coffee table or bookshelf or whatever it is that you house your album so this is the album I'm going to use now in comparison to what I had last year I'm going to see if I have my other little album this is a six by eight album I used a four by four album last year so you can see it's quite big my other December daily albums are also a six by eight album so I'm kind of I went from large to small to large again which I'm okay with I was looking for a little bit more room which I talked about in the video that's before this one where I showed you my 2016 album. So I'm moving on up like the Jeffersons back to the six by eight album. So let me show you all the rest of the elements that come with the Joy Kit. All right, so let's start with the pattern papers first. In the kit, you get six pattern papers and two double-sided solid cardstock. So this first one's called Trees and Wood Grain. It has little Christmas trees here against sort of an olive colored green, very pretty. And then on the back is a beautiful wood grain pattern. Now, if you're not familiar with Felicity Jane, all of the materials in the Felicity Jane kits are exclusive to Felicity Jane so they're all designed by Felicity Jane for the most part so gorgeous gorgeous product great high quality and then here the marketing uh, tag or the strip down here are these cute little red snowflakes it's very pretty the next up oh I just love a red polka dot paper it's so pretty so gorgeous this nice little small dotted paper with the white dots red background and then here on the strip it says happy Christmas with little tiny Christmas trees and then on the back is this beautiful floral pattern and I believe the second album you can choose from has a floral pattern that's similar to this it's really gorgeous this one's called floral and dots Next up is this really fun stripe paper, the chevron paper. This one's called chevron and asterisk. And on the back, of course, you have a little asterisk and then a little decorative strip here. 
with red, pink, and green lines going across. Of course, no Christmas kit would be complete without a red and stripe page. I'm just telling you, this is absolutely gorgeous. This one's called Diagonal and Dash. And here's the B side. Very pretty, nice little black dashes going across the page. And look at that little deer down there on the little strip. Those are so fun to use. Next up is Snow and Geometric. So on this page, it's a nice subtle pink with little snowflakes around, both little circles and then little stars right there, which is really pretty. Very, very subtle, but gorgeous paper. And on the back, you get this geometric design. I will more than likely use this side and then a little strip with some white dots against a olive colored green. This one's called Gingham and Waves. I love a gorgeous gingham pattern, particularly for holiday decorating and scrapbooking. Very, very pretty color. And then on the back is this wave design. And I believe this is black and white wave design. And then there's a little strip of numbers, which is perfect for documenting the holiday season. It goes from one to 31. And then lastly, out of the paper, again, you get two pieces of solid cardstock. So we have a nice green along with a red. And then on the back, a nice subtle green, a lighter green along with a light pink. So here's the A side of the paper. So you can see here in a second that the color stories are going to be drastically different from A to B. So more greens, reds, and blacks here. And then when you flip it on the back, You've got a lot of beautiful pink, black and white floral along with the green. How fun is that? Now also included in the paper pack is a set of six by eight inserts, which are super fun for a December daily album. They're already pre-punched, so you don't have to worry about that. And it's just thin cardstock and it'll work just fine in an album. This one says believe in a nice script font. And then on the back, it has the nice little Swiss dots. This one is Christmas wish list, which I think is perfect to document all your wonderful Christmas wishes. And then on the back is more lines for journaling, which if you're like me and you like to journal, this is awesome. And then you have another one with this gingham print that says today's stories. And then on the back, it has some more of that beautiful gingham print. So I'm so happy to see that this is added to the kit. So cute, very useful. Included in the joy kit is a set of the designer vellum pieces. And I think these are 12 by six. I'm gonna open them up and show them to you. So first up, we got these fun little Christmas trees that are printed all across this vellum, very pretty. Also included is this gold wood grain design love this then you have another gold embossed design with these nice little wavy lines going across the page also included is this black stripe design and this really gorgeous gingham design next up is a six piece set of the joy acetate pages and you can use this as dividers in your album so let me open this up and give you a closer look all right first up is this design with the word december written across the page then you have one that says fa la 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 Let me see if I can get something to sort of bring that out. There we go. So you have fa la 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 that's printed across the six by six piece. Nice white scripty font. You also get a grid design as well as a snowflake design. And let me grab a dark piece of paper so you can see the snowflakes on that. How cute is that? Those are so pretty. Then there's a black polka dot design. Also included in the six piece set is this gold marble design. Now the cool thing about these pieces is that they're already punched. So all you have to do is add them to your album. Also included in the kit is a set of the Joy Foam Alpha letters. And these are all small lowercase letters with both letters and numbers. And no Felicity Jane kit will be complete without the exclusive stamp sets. And this one is the Joy stamp set. And so it has the following sentiments, Christmas cheer, tradition, twinkle, sparkle, joy, the most wonderful time of the year, be merry, uh, December, dear Santa, family time, the gift of giving, holiday details, magic, as well as making memories. This little box here that says December, a little Christmas tree icon, a circle that says the story. There's a little set of dots here, just three little dots that you can use to accent your project. And then a little stamp that looks like a star. You'll also receive these word stickers. So lots of fun sentiments there. December, festive, reindeer, gingerbread, cookies for Santa, Christmas, wonderland. And it looks like there's one sheet included in this set. You also get a set of wood veneer numbers that comes in this gorgeous tin, which I think is perfect for organizing just about any small embellishment. So you'll get numbers one through 31. And I like how the two digit numbers are attached together. That makes numbering the pages so easy. And so you can 
can keep them just the way they are. You can heat emboss them. You can paint them. You can do all kinds of things. You can maybe use them in a combination with other font stickers as well. I think I'm going to use all of these to serve as the dates for my December daily, or at least to label the days of my December daily. So we'll see. But I absolutely love wood veneer. And so I was excited to see that this came with the kit. You also get a 15 piece set of the Joy Chipboard buttons. And these are super fun. So let me open these up and show you some of them. So you have one that says presents, shopping, um, pajamas, cookies, um, what's this other one? Twinkle. So, so lots of really fun chipboard buttons that you can add to your project. You'll also receive this small little container of black and white tassels with gold hardware on it, which I think are really, really pretty. Also included is a set of flares. So this one says joy. This one has a star, a little snowflake, and a Christmas tree. And these teeny, 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 tiny Christmas trees. How cute are they? And some stars. And speaking of these little tiny Christmas trees and stars, you can purchase more of these on the Felicity Jane site to add to your joy kit. But also included in the kit are these really fun hexagon sequin in both pink and red. Also included in the kit are some fun fibers that you can add to tags and to pages and make bows and such. And you also get three small white doilies. Next up, you get a roll of thin washi tape. So these are gold foiled hearts against a white background. Next up, you get a set of six tags. So this one says Christmas. Here's a nice gingham design, a floral design, red and white stripe, a polka dot, and a Christmas tree. You also get a set of nine patches, and these are really fun to use. I'm gonna really challenge myself to use these up in my project. So let me pull these out so you can get a closer look. So included in that set is a floral patch. You get four stars, two Christmas trees, and the word joy. And this will add a lot of texture and interest to any scrapbooking project that you do this holiday season. Next up, you get a 75 piece set of the joy puffy shapes. So you get a set of black, white, red, sort of this light olive green, and then a nice soft pink. Also included is a set of three by four journaling cards that's perfect for a project like December Daily. So there's a design with Christmas presents, a gingham design, a white and red stripe, a December bucket list so you can make a list of all the fun things you want to do this season. And you also get this really fun design. It looks like little strung up light bulbs. This one says peace, joy, and love, a beautiful Christmas wreath, a card that says happy Christmas. This card says joy aptly titled because the kit's called Joy. You get this Christmas tree shaped numbered journal card, another gingham design, and then a polka dot design. And last but not least, you get a set of die cuts and there's 30 pieces in the die cut pack. And this is the Joy die cut pack. And here is the doll called Joy. She represents all of that as well this holiday season with her cute little black and white striped skirt along with her presents. You also get some labels, a tab that says Merry and Bright, some little strips, decorative strips here. And you get this little fun little banner of little bulbs, some stars, a little phrase that says fa la la, a couple of floral elements, well, more than a couple, you get four floral elements, some uh, pine cones, as well as two little Christmas trees and some snowflakes. All right, so these are the beautiful materials that I'm gonna be using for my December Daily 2017 album. So what I wanna do is go ahead and get all these things organized into one container, because it makes it a lot easier to work on your December Daily when you have everything together. I might pull in some elements that I used last year for my December Daily if I feel that this isn't gonna be enough. Again, I'm trying to keep my design simple and clean, focused on the story, not a whole lot of over embellishing in this particular project, but we'll see how it goes. So I'm gonna go ahead, get all these things organized. I'm gonna show you the container that I am using and how I organize my December daily elements. All right, so I have all of my elements organized in my iris case. I've always organized my December daily items in this manner. You can get this iris case at any of your craft and hobby stores. I do have an insert in here that's not available in stores anymore, but I think you can still find it online. So I have all of my elements here in this little divider insert and this is made by Iris as well so I have all my wood veneer pieces and my badges and tags and all kinds of fun things here so I can easily reach for it and keep it organized and then underneath here I have all of my paper so essentially things that wouldn't necessarily fit here in the tray 
So I have all of my paper elements here with my 12 by 12 papers underneath. I have my font stickers and my inserts as well as my vellum pages, my uh, the six by 12 ones. And then of course some other elements here with the stamps and the stickers. And then some more of the dividers that are here as well. So I can keep those all here at the bottom. And if I want to, I will add to this as I see fit. But I think for now I'm gonna work with this and see where it takes me. So next up after this video, I'm going to show you how I put together my December Daily album. And sort of the idea behind the concept of December Daily is that you would go ahead and prep your album first so that when you start the holiday season, all you have to do is print your photos and write your stories down. But I'm kind of two minds. While I like that process, I also don't know what I want to do from day to day in terms of the design of my album. So I'm gonna get the basic construction of the album together and I'll show you that process. If you have any questions about any of the products that are featured here on this preview video, go ahead and post it down below. Make sure you subscribe to the Victoria Marie YouTube channel and there's a little bell indicator. If you click on that, that means YouTube will notify you every time that I post a video here on the Victoria Marie YouTube channel. If, if you're not following me on Instagram and Facebook, make sure you do that. All those links are posted down below. And of course the icons are there at the top of the screen. All right, guys, happy December daily. I hope that you're going to take on this project this year. Don't make it stressful. It's going to be a lot of fun. So stay tuned for my December daily album setup.